Hello guys and welcome, this is Michael. Today I wanted to show you a settlement, it's called the castle. It's my favorite settlement, because it's a castle for one, and I think there's a lot you could do with it. Now, I haven't done that much, I have a lot more area in here I could do stuff, because I beat the game already, I'm level 40, I'm almost level 41, that's probably when I'll quit playing, because I can finally put a, another point in the science, like a jetpack for my power, I just want to see how that's like. I'll probably start a new character after that. So, uh, this isn't like a complete finish, like I'm done with this castle, you know, because, you know, I, what I plan on doing is making like a marketplace like that, but like using this area right here as a marketplace, and this area is something else over there, something else over there, but like I said, I didn't really plan on playing that long, I didn't want really to find the resources. This is kind of just a video to show you what it is, show you what it's like, uh, if you want to start a settlement, and you know, maybe you haven't found a good area, or maybe you just, just haven't, like I said, found a good area, or... You just haven't even got Fallout yet, and you want to see what some of the settlements. Maybe you pick one yourself. Now to unlock this area, you gotta. You can always come over here and unlock it, level one. But for some reason, unless you actually do the mission for it, that ain't working. Which is, it, it, it don't have to work. It's not like you have to have that to work. And there's a lot of like Myrlic egg sacks around here, so it's kind of hard to make anything. It looks awful, god awful. So I recommend you do the mission for it first. And if you don't, you want to unlock that area. And you want to unlock the artillery right there. So basically, you do the uh, mission for the Minutemen. I don't know if there's a certain level ca level you have to get to to unlock this area. I don't know. I kind of just... I had already beat the game so before I even talked to Preston again. So I don't know if there's a certain level or maybe a point in the storyline where you can do this. I'm assuming you can just... Uh, do, there's another settlement over there. I'm assuming you can just do the, yeah. I guess, Minuteman storyline and this will be unlocked. But anyway, I like this area. Um, let's go over the... Uh, plus sides. Plus side is, you do have a kind of a limited working source. If you go into your, this, you know, you got a little bit of area outside of this all the way around. You can make stuff, probably put gardens out here. You know, I got a, somewhat of a garden over there, because it's actually dirt, believe it or not. But there's not really that flat out there, so. Honestly, your best place is doing something here, which is uh, limited because it's a little circle, I mean. You don't have that much area. But I like the area I like this area because one, I'm not that I didn't plan on making it that big, you know. If you plan on making a huge settlement, this might not be the area for you. Um I didn't plan on making it that big, so it's not that big of a deal for me. But just for you, like I said, just to let you know. Um Yeah, uh let's go ahead and go over some my defenses. Now if you haven't played Fallout, maybe haven't made a settlement yet. Defense is something you need. Actually I don't think you do because at least a couple different because here's the thing, I've played this game 40 levels, almost 41 levels now, and I've been attacked one time, and the whole time now, actually, excuse me, I've been attacked twice. One was my main settlement, which is a sanctuary, which ended like that, and another one, there was a settlement that there was like one person at. So, I really, I have really got attacked, so I don't know how important a defense is, because, to be honest, I've only been attacked twice. And they both last like no no time, but I still make it anyway, just because. And I don't know what you get from making a settlement. I don't know if there's a plus side to it. I'm not sure. Anyway, so here's basically my main setup for I guess the defense. I have a tripwire mine. I have walls. So they have to go through the tripwire mine. Um, and as soon as they do, it goes off. It supplies power to the rocket. The the flamethrower, which deals damage, and that, which also deals damage, and it supplies power to the siren. So to like make siren noises and the settlement people will know also the Minuteman. Hey, there's somebody raiding. Or I guess it's called raiding and attacking. Let's go attack them. So you know, get up here, post up and shoot. I also got a laser turret there and a rocket turret. So this area is pretty protected, even though it's kind of like a, a small area. I mean, it's not the main area. Probably the most protected though. Let's go to the other one. Now, defense. Like I said, defense is something you don't. I don't think you need because, like I said, I only been attacked twice. It's been by like. Both of them is like two, three raiders. So should you go into this much in defense? Probably not. But I'm optimistic. I think maybe something will happen. You know, if it does. Uh, same thing here. You know, tripwire mine, walls, a couple of turrets down here, traps. And make sure you set the tripwires to go off on enemies only. Uh, if you have to have a terminal for that, which you can make. Make sure you set that because not you know like a if you're you know if caravan comes through here, they're gonna get. I mean, the turrets ain't gonna attack them because not enemies, but 
any traps you have, whale, so just let you know. There's a couple food area. Yeah, uh, the only downside of this is, you know, there's a couple walls you gotta patch up, even though you don't have to. You're not really gonna get attacked, I don't think. And even if you do, I think they're just gonna die really fast, and you're not gonna start to come and flank through the areas you're not. But I did it anyway, just to make it look cooler. I mean, not really look cooler, just if I ever do get attacked, one, and two, I guess it makes it look more defensible, more strategic. Now, this is the area, this is the... It is pretty. Yeah, I know, I, I like it. Um, let's go ahead and show you the war room. You gotta do the... Basically get done with Howdy. the campaign. Not the campaign, not the storyline, but the Minuteman storyline to unlock this. You know, you got your... Nice, nah, sick, there's XO1 armor in here, and there's also... Uh, T-51B. I'm joking. The T-51B and X... X-01? X... Yeah, X-01 armor isn't in here. So don't think it is. I actually brought it in here myself. I like... Those are my two favorite armor sets. I like this one because the helmet has more of like a cartoonish feel. I don't know why I think that, but compared to the other ones. And this one just looks, you know, it, it, I, I like it. I put military green on it. It looks nice. My cat's playing with the <laughs> chimes over there. <laughs> As I said, I hadn't finished. But you do get like a fat man in here and all that good stuff. All these wires right here, which I'll show you on the place over here, is already here. So really, there's not much wiring to do here. There's also, there's also lights and everything. See, all this wiring right here. This wasn't here. I had to put this here. The lights and the wiring that does all this was already here. Like this light, that light, the wiring. That stuff's all here. And here's your main uh, bedroom, by the way. I'll show, you, show the air here. All this was already here. Minus, of course, the power arm. The Raider. I like the Raider power arm. I don't, it's not that good, but I like it. It looks cool. I put the I put those beds here and some of these beds here because you gotta have a lot of beds to your settlement. And up here there's, there's back up to the castle. This is definitely my favorite settlement so far. There's a couple I wanna I guess wanna unlock, I just haven't yet. But yeah, I like the settlement and guys, if this is something you like, uh go ahead and leave a like and subscribe. Like I wanna do more with it, but like I said, I, I think this next level when I unlock the jetpack for my power armor. I just use that. I just wanna see how it, what it does. As I do that, I'm probably not going to plan this save anymore after a new character. So I didn't want to put too much time and effort into this, but I did want to show it off because I think it's probably the best settlement in my opinion so far. Stupid cat. There is a settlement over there. Um, I could unlock it. But it's basically like a pretty. I don't, I don't think it'll be that well. You, if you want, if you need wood, all those trees over there, you can scrap all those. That's definitely the area for wood. And probably scrap iron too, not iron steel. You can get you get a look on this area. Um, oh, the, also the, I want to show you the artillery. The artillery. The last thing I want to show you is really nice. You know, I guess it's more of a not nice and then it's the best thing in the world, but it definitely looks cool. So if you throw, you get these special things. I'll go ahead and throw it. How far did that go? That went far enough. I just didn't want to hit my settlement. And they're called artillery smoke grenades. And if, you, if you're not at your settlement where you can hear it, you gotta use the Radio Freedom. Radio Freedom. Radio Freedom. Um, All quiet. This Which actually has pretty far range. Like, so. Preparing to fire for effect. See, I could've been like over there and used it. You can't be out of range. You can also put this in any settlement afterwards. Now, it takes them a second to get locked in. And they do that about, I'd say about five times. And I mean, it, it's a good uh, plus if I guess you're a lower level and you need to find an area you need to do. But honestly, if you're not this close to the castle, you're like, you know, over there, somewhere farther in the city. It takes a little bit more to get there. And I don't know if it's really worth it at that point because, you, me, I could have already killed them by the time they get it set up and shoot. But if you're a low level, sure. Like I said, guys, that's this is the castle setting. I'll show it on the map if you want to come here. It's like all the way in the water. It's like a little area here. I got some people when they're happy. But yeah, this is the the castle, guys. Um, if you liked it, guys, just let me know. If you want to see more settlements like this, they're still shooting it. But yeah, if you want to see more settlements, you know, or maybe me, me put more effort into this one. Just let me know. Uh, it's not stuff I wanted to do because I don't plan on playing it too long. But if people want to see it, I didn't. Really I'll definitely flesh it out more. Um, and guys, if, if you want to see something like this, maybe a different settlement you can have, 
let me know guys in the comments below. And thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you guys later.